Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Heiser. Thank you so much for coming along. So we are playing Planet Zoo and we are in Chiesto Park for episode 8 today. And we are building the Barbarossa habitat and we kind of made, we called it the island. It's called the Barbarossa Island. It's not like a huge Mediterranean island or anything like that. It's just a tiny little island within the land where the water surrounding it. And I wanted to uh, kind of build something that I saw on Pinterest. And it was this kind of platform that came out and it extended into the actual island. But I thought I could use the same idea and I could literally take away the island where the guests would walk and just keep like a, a platform hovering over the water viewing into the area. So with this one, in terms of architectural buildings and stuff, there's not too much in terms of um, like work went into the actual design. It was more about actually making the uh, enclosure or habitat to be more sort of Earth-like and not Earth-like, like, like we're on Mars right now, um, more, more sort of earthy where you've got like more natural things going on. And again, it's always the idea to go with this really sort of modern look and kind of keep things really sleek and just kind of like, uh, I always say simple, but I don't like to use the word because it makes it sound like it's easy or it's really basic. But when I say simple, I mean like a, a clean look to it. So yeah, with this, I, I wanted an island and you, you got like a, for the guests, they've got like a really good view. I think they can come onto the platform. It's not like they haven't got to walk around loads of corridors to get there. It's just a little turning off the main road or main main road. I, I've, just, I've literally been driving about half an hour ago. That's why I just said main road. So no, you go on the main path and as you come along that you can see literally straight into the island and you got you're quite close again to the animals. I think that's really nice. Again, the animals can come right up to the barrier. I mean, Logically, they could probably jump over it, but I don't think, you know, in the game they have or they would. So um, you can kind of get away with that. But I think, you know, you can interact with them really closely, which is really nice. Now, I don't know if you've noticed at all as well that where I'm building this is where um, the sun bear habitat was. And it's I've had to remove it from the park because I now think that the main cause of my memory spike was coming from that habitat and that was my original diagnosis when I was going around the park is that was my first thing that I thought it was the that habitat and then I went to the Binjurong habitat and it was the gate that was crashing the park but in terms of the memory issue I was getting I noticed it when I was building the path across the um where the waterfall is and as I was going across I was deleting the grass underneath and it was freezing I was like oh not again so I boot up task manager had a look and I saw that there was uh, about 25 gigabytes this time so not as much as last time almost half as less but obviously it's there and it shouldn't be nowhere near that high um, again when I see my wife playing I say just pause for a second like can I check your computer see how much your memory you're using in your park and it'll be like five or six gigabytes. And I'll be like, you've got a park three times the size of mine. Like, why is mine doing this? So I deleted it, saved it, closed down the game, booted it back up, and I've not had any of those issues whatsoever. So again, I think that habitat, I, I, I don't want to completely get rid of it. So I'm going to still use that idea and I'm just going to modify it a little bit because I've got an idea that every single piece of that build, which was probably about I'd say like nearly a thousand pieces has duplicated so the wooden poles there's multiple of them instead of just the one single ones and again I think using the TV monitors on the floor uh, the projectors gives off um, some sort of problem I'm not sure why I mean I'm just I'm not just assuming here so I could be completely wrong but I had to bid it off and just yeah I, I couldn't I couldn't do it like, I thought I'm building again and you're just causing lag but um, anyway guys as enough of me yapping, I'm going on now. I'm going to end up reading the book to you. So uh, enjoy the rest of the video. I hope you like it. Again, it's nothing super, super duper. But again, it's uh, just kind of keeping it nice and clean and sleek as always. So enjoy the video, guys. And I will hopefully see you in the next episode. And please don't be afraid to give it a thumbs up. Your support means so much to me. And I'm always thankful, guys. So yes, I'll see you very soon. See you later. Bye-bye.